Hey Tribe, Lee Zello here and in this video we're going to talk about how to create a high converting lead magnet for your practice so that you can grow your email list and that you can nurture your prospective patients to the point where they know, love and trust you enough to book that phone consultation. So if you're brand new to this, we're going to talk about what lead magnets are and the criteria for high performing lead magnets. And then we're going to go into actual examples from health practitioners so that you can see what lead magnets look like uh, in real life. And then finally, um, if you want to go even deeper on this, we have a step by step process how to go uh, about building a lead magnet as well as how to promote lead magnets because obviously once you have a lead magnet in place you now have to get traffic to the lead magnets you have to get eyeballs to your lead market magnets in order to build your list now a lead magnet is a magnet for your ideal patients to get on your email list and the way this is typically accomplished is through downloadable assets like a checklist a cheat sheet a tip sheet a decision guide um, a, a quiz or a video series and so anything of value to your prospective patients in exchange for their email address and the way this is done is through an opt-in page or sometimes called a squeeze page where they can enter their email address and then um, get onto your mailing list now uh, for your lead magnets to be effective, there's a couple things that need to happen. Number one, they need to be relevant to your services. So the lead magnet needs to enroll ideal patient prospects that are perfect for your clinical services, right? Number two, um, the lead magnet needs to address a current and very specific pain point of your prospect. So for your prospect to decide that they actually want to part with the email address, you need to provide something of value to them that actually solves a current problem that they're having. Now, this can't be a massively big problem that you're trying to solve, but it needs to be a small problem that they're currently experiencing that puts them then on a path towards building a relationship with you. And number three, your lead magnet needs to provide a transformational experience. Um, oftentimes when you just provide written word, written content, your audience is not consuming the lead magnet. As a result, nothing ever changes. And so if you can't create an experience for your prospects, uh, whether that's through a video on the thank you page or the lead magnet itself is a video series or an audio series where people can experience more than just a written word. They can uh, hear your voice. They can see your face. That's when you create a bond a relationship with your prospect. And that is really the first step for them to take action and move towards you. Now, one of the examples could be, let's say if you were in the autism area, a uh, lead magnet around four things your autistic child wished its teachers knew. Can you see how irresistible this is for a parent that has a child with autism? You know, they, they, there's this fear of missing out or FOMO um, because your lead magnet could have the one magic bullet, the one nugget that could change everything for the parent. And obviously, which parent wouldn't want a better uh, academic and social experience for their child, especially uh, when, when we're talking about autism, right? And so this is the level of standard that you want to meet with your lead magnet, that it becomes so irresistible that it's this level of fear of missing out that is really ensuring that your lead magnet has a high conversion rate. Because no parent that gets to see this lead magnet will say, nah, I already know what uh, this person is going to talk about right and so this is what I mean by transformational experience you can't be boring you can't be predictable you have to have new information that really massively revitalizes people's mind so that they realize wow nobody has talked about it in this way and because this person has talked about it this way I want to move forward with this person now let's talk about the five criteria for high converting lead magnets and number one it needs to solve a specific problem for your ideal patient prospect and what i mean by this is the lead magnet is really a, a tool to attract the right patients on your list and repel everyone else so what you have to do is that the problem that the lead magnet promises to solve for your prospect needs to be very specific to them so that it only filters out those people that you want on your email list and nobody else and the reason for this is really that in the follow-up emails you need to know very specifically who they are and what's relevant to them so that you can actually deliver the information and be very relevant in their life right if your lead magnet is very generic and everybody signs up for it then obviously the follow-up will be so much harder because you have no idea who these people are that you're trying to talk to and because you have no idea who they are then your messaging is not relevant to them now you want to solve a very specific problem for them but it's not as big as let's say solving diabetes right 
um, that would be almost impossible and your prospect wouldn't believe you that you could actually help them uh, combat diabetes. So we want to have something very simple, something with a two or three minute read. They do one thing different and that makes a big difference in their life. So for instance, uh, the example with the autism guide, you know, if you had four things that you could give to a teacher um, to do differently with um, their autistic child, that would make a big difference, right? So it doesn't have to be complicated, it just needs to be impactful. Now, number two, it needs to be actionable and easy to implement. And so you should not create a 70 page ebook that nobody's going to read. It's much more important that you have something super actionable, something that's easy to understand for them so that they can move forward and actually implement it in their life. Now, number three, it needs to deliver a quick win or create an experience. So for example, um, if you were in, in the meditation space, you know, what better way than giving people an audio MP3 of an MP, uh, a meditation or maybe a breathing exercise and people can implement it right then and there. They feel refreshed, they feel less stressed and you make an immediate impact on them that now positions you in a positive light because we have, you have actually help them accomplish a goal in a very short amount of time and people know that what you talk about works and so now they're more disposed to follow you along and trust you with the next step that you ask them to do, right? Now number four, it needs to be quick to consume and easy to understand. Um, and ultimately, it's all about creating remarkable experiences, right? And for that to happen, people need to feel empowered. They need to feel that this was helpful, that that actually moved the needle towards where they want to go. And so this is not the time to deliver a 70 page ebook or a two hour webinar, um, even though it's video content. Uh, this is really something that if they don't know you yet, they're, they're what we call a cold audience. You need to build trust with them and at most they will give you two, three minutes to make your case. So you want to use those two, three minutes and actually create a result in, in that uh, span of time. And it, it can be an actual result. It could be an amazing insight, a clinical pearl of your wisdom that changes the game forever for them. And then finally at number five, it needs to provide transformational value. And you know, I'm always reminded of this Geico commercial. Everybody knows that 15 minutes save you 15% or more. It can't be that obvious, right? So whenever your lead magnet comes out, if people think they already know what you're gonna teach them, they're not gonna opt in. So, you know, six ways to eat healthier, most people have heard it, most people have seen really bad lead magnet examples and they're jaded and they're not opting in, right? So you wanna really create that fear of missing out or FOMO um, to really make sure that whenever people see it, ooh, I gotta have this, you know, I can't wait, I need to do this right now, I shouldn't be waiting till later and forgetting about it. So it needs to be transformational in the title and then obviously what you deliver in the lead magnet should be transformational as well so that you change their perception of what you can do, you establish that you have the expertise for them uh, to get the results and that they should trust you uh, with the next step in the journey. Now here's an example of a lead magnet guide, uh, the five warning signs you may have leaky gut. Uh, you can see the example of a landing page where there's a logo, um, there's no main navigation and just a button for people to um, add their first name and email address. So that's one way to deliver a downloadable PDF guide uh, for audiences. Now the next example here is a free ebook to get all the details on the autoimmune protocol specifics, a printable enjoy and avoid list, a dining out guide and meal planning tips. And that writes alongside with uh, an article around the AIP diet, right? Next, an example from Dr. Jolene Brighton, a free ebook on uh, post birth control syndrome detox diet quick start guide. So here it's positioned as a quick start guide to balance hormones, improve your energy and eliminate symptoms of PBCS. Another example from Jolene is a free hormone starter kit with a seven day meal plan and recipe guide. Um, yet another example here is from Andre Nakayama and the Functional Nutrition Lab uh, where they offer the field guide to functional nutrition. In this case, I would say this is definitely on the bigger size, 70 plus pages, five free tools and terms to know, but that's how their organization operates and so in, in their case it works. Here's an example of a healthy gut quiz from SCD Lifestyle. So in this case, uh, the quiz asks, is your body secretly suffering from a leaky gut? Take the three minute quiz to find out and then you can see here the questions that people are asking um, as you go through uh, the 
a quiz and they have like a couple pages, one, two, three steps before they ask you to opt in. Another example of a quiz is from Rejuve Medical. Um, is it just aging or is it really your hormones? Take the quiz and find out. And so, um, you know, they ask a number of questions in terms of what's your age range, uh, what's your uh, gender, etc. And again, at the end, they ask for an email address to send you the uh, results. Another quiz example is how healthy is your practice marketing? This is something that you find on our website at bigboost.marketing slash practice marketing quiz. And again, you uh, start the quiz, you answer a couple questions and then you get a different result videos and follow up based on your answers. Another example of lead magnets is a video series. So a very good example is from Sachin Patel with his 30 ways in 30 days to transform your life. And that's very popular where he's delivering 30 days of short videos uh, via email that um, provide different aspects to improve your health. And we've built a video series very similar to that um, around boosting your patient acquisition in the next 10 days that you'll find at bigboost.marketing slash 10 in 10. So now that you understand what goes into creating a high converting lead magnet and you've seen actual examples from lead magnets in the integrative medicine space, I want to offer you my free step-by-step -step guide on how to create high converting lead magnets. In this guide, you will see the same framework that we take our clients at Big Boost Marketing through with the exact questions that we're asking them. So be sure to download this, simply click the link below this video. And if you have any questions about uh, lead magnets, um, how to create lead magnets, what topics to pick, how to write the lead magnet, or what media is appropriate for lead magnet, simply comment below this video. And if this video was helpful to you, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Simply click the subscribe button and hit the bell to be notified every time a new video goes live. And share it with a colleague that needs to see this and comment as well as like the video so I know what to create more in the future. So see you in the next video.